The leader of the United Republican Party defends former MP Charnas Prasad. More details in this report. So the opposition bring up the no confidence, and they was right to do it, to bring up the no confidence, right? They was perfectly right in order, you know, and the people vote. If Charandas, you know, vote for them and he said he vote with his conscience, you know, God bless him. Right? But somebody has to do something because things is not going as it should go in Guyana. Leader of the United Republican Party, Dr. Vishnu Bandhu, in a recent interview with Channel 8 News, defended the move that was made by former MP Charandas Prasad whose vote during the December 21st No Confidence motion triggered early elections to be held in the coming months. Mr. Bandu, in his statements, noted that the former MP's dual citizenship should not be an area of contention in regards to the validity of his vote. Half of the parliament have dual citizenship as far as I'm concerned. Not only in this government, the last government too. Half of them got dual citizenship. If Charanda had dual citizenship, what's wrong with that? Eh? He's a Guyanese. That should have nothing to do with this. You know? But they will find all kind of things. I am sure all of them know Charanda has also a Canadian uh, citizenship. I'm sure about that. You don't say nothing. But something will go in your favor. So now you will start to paint all these things. But let them examine themselves. Each one of them in the parliament examine themselves who and who has dual citizenship. Right? And if you if you take out all those people who got dual citizenship, you don't got people to run Guyana. He further expressed that shouldn't be a thing. Somebody come to help. They are born Guyanese, they go and they study abroad, they they, they, they get their, their citizenship, they come back to serve. Huh? You know? So I don't care what anyone say. I know what is going on. I know they're, they're painting Charandas with all color of paint and to make it look bad. But they can't make it look bad. In my book, he is a hero because he's going to come out and speak amongst those people in there. No, nobody else could not have done it. He did it. And I'm proud of him for what he did. Chief Justice Roxanne George has since been tasked with handing down a ruling on all cases that have been brought forth following the no-confidence vote, which includes the validity of MP Persaud's vote. This decision is set to be finalized before the end of January 2019. Sasha Ramsaran reporting for Channel 8 News.